Now, your WLKY weather with Chief Meteorologist Jay Cardosi. All right, hot weather out there on this Friday afternoon. We went all the way up to 93 degrees for the official high here in town. Ninth time this summer season with highs up over the 90 degree mark. And just to give you some perspective, last year at this time through today, we had 28 90 degree days. How about that? And for the entire summer season, we averaged 37 of those 90 degree days. Outside right now, plenty hot. We have partly to mostly sunny skies, 93, 75 the extremes, no rainfall today in the old rain bucket, but we do have a very good chance for rain, especially tomorrow. More on that in just a bit. Right now, as hot as it's been all day, 93. And with that humidity, 41% and the dew point in the sticky range, 66. Well, you factor in those numbers with that number, you get this right here, the feel like, and that's still a whopping 97. So anything you have planned outdoors, lots of water, stay hydrated. There are your numbers, upper 80s, low 90s across much of the region, as hot as 94 right now in Corridon. When you factor in that humidity, plenty of mid to upper 90s still being felt with 99, the heat index in Huntingburg at this time. Radar scan is clear around the metro and it's clear around the viewing area, but yeah, we do have some scattered showers and storms out near Evansville into western Kentucky. I think the deeper we go into the evening, 9, 10, 11 o'clock tonight, it's possible a few cells could try to form in our far southwestern communities, but a bulk of the rain, the good chances, if you will, will hold off until tomorrow. So let's talk about the weekend now. Here's the big picture and you can see the quiet skies across the region today, but just off to the west of us, the energy is organizing once again, as is the moisture combining to produce quite a bit of rain, a big complex of showers and storms bubbling up. And this is the energy that's gonna be riding in our direction to bring us that rain chance tomorrow. So impact weather on the way in the form of scattered showers and storms on your Saturday. Widespread severe weather? No, I am not expecting that at all. But any of the heavier cores could have some gusty winds from time to time and some torrential downpours as well. Now this evening, most will stay dry and plenty warm. Here in the metro, we'll be right around that 90 degree mark, if not a little bit better, next couple three hours, and then slip into the middle and upper 80s by late this evening. Here's your future cast now. I want to take you through tomorrow, 6 a.m., a lot of clouds. Notice the scattered showers and storms west of 65, approaching the I-65 corridor and much of the viewing area through the morning, through midday, a little break in the afternoon, and then a few more widely scattered storms possible late tomorrow and tomorrow evening. As a result, temperatures will be cooler tomorrow in the low to middle 80s. And after we have that rain chance tomorrow, Sunday is the pick of the weekend. We'll go partly cloudy, dry skies return 91, although an air quality alert has been issued for Sunday. A few clouds and very warm this evening will be in the 80s. Detailed 12-hour forecast for your Saturday. Have the umbrellas ready. A scattering of showers and storms expected. High temperatures of 85. Sunday, there's that air quality alert. What for? Haze and smoke again, guys. It's oh. coming back in from the north mm. on Sunday. Mm. Uh, and you can see next week is unsettled. Just about a day-to-day -day chance for a few scattered storms.